last episode of the Ardennes week. Last episode, and then I don't see you for a while. <laughs> yeah, it's the uh, last hard push uh, for this uh, first half of the season. It's, uh, it's a beautiful day. So some vacation after this? Yeah, uh, but first fully focus to the finish line, and then uh, yeah, what happens, happens next week. <laughs> Woo! Beautiful to see all the fans here, and uh, I hope uh, you, I see all of you on the finish also. Welcome to Liège Baston Liège 2023. This is the 109th edition of cycling's oldest monument, first held back in 1892. <laughs> Well, the big news from the early part of the race was that Tadej Pogacar was forced to abandon. The Slovenian was caught up in a crash with Mikel Onore after 84.5 kilometers, and he injured his wrist, ending his hopes of the Ardennes treble. Yeah, very hard, but then, yeah, we made the best out of it. Yeah, then I get the opportunity. I try to stay in front, but yeah, it was not so bad result for me, but uh, I couldn't stay with, with Remco or when they go. Uh, but then at the end, uh, it was difficult with sprint. Yeah, I think at the end I get the top 10, so it's not too bad. Unfortunately, today, today he was uh, involved in a big crash in a descent. Uh, of a multiple fracture to the uh, left wrist is now under operation and we wish he will recover quite fast uh, for the Tour de France. At the same time, uh, fortunately, Mark Hirschi was in a good day. He took uh, the responsibility for, uh, for the, the result. He did a, a very nice 10th place, so congratulations to him. And uh, of course, big, big congratulations to Remco Evenepoel with an incredible great show today.